Hello and welcome back to Against the Storm. In our last episode, we started a new town in the Sealed Forest and have made some progress toward getting to the Seal, which we will need to start working toward. We could always do the packs, but it's a lot of packs and we don't have any better pack. We do have better provisions. We don't have very many better pack recipes, so that's a little bit tough. Uh, so we could open or send the caches or we could install the eight rain engines. We only have four buildings though. So installing the rain engines may not be the best option, but we are getting one more building here, uh, but it's probably gonna be the a farm. Actually, it's definitely going to be the herb garden. Let's do that actually right away. And then let's also take a look at that cornerstone because I don't like any of these. It's very rare that I don't like any of them, but as uh, I think it was Steven said in the comments, that's what a reroll is for. So let's click it. Trade logs, that could always work, makes the traders faster. Advanced herbalism though, that pairs pretty well with our building choice. So we could probably do that. Or we could um, gain 12 amber for every 50 ale produced. Ale would be a good thing here, um, but I think Advanced herbalism, herbalism is too good to pass up. So let's do that. Let's uh, get started on building some fields here, like that and like that. We'll get at least two of the herb gardens put in here. Uh, one there, maybe one over here someplace. We have to find where that's supposed to go. But we also need to remove some of these big uglies here, I think. Are you masking or standing on? Yes, you are. All right, so let's see where that's supposed to go before we make some deeper plans here. Uh, I guess I could put it there, or I could put it here. This might be better. So let's let's remove some of these big ugly trees, and uh, yeah, that should be fine. Remove some of those. That one, that one, and that one. There might be one more in there. I'll wait until we remove what we have to to see how we want to do it. Um, I would like to bring the road right through here, so I think I would like to remove a few more trees. These are the regular trees, so I got to be very very prudent with it, but I think I'm just bring the road down, around, and then zigzag it over a bit here, and then zigzag it over again to bring it down into this glade. Uh, so we'll get some of that road put in now, because we need to get past this co uh, copper here, and then we'll do the rest of it as we get more, um, more space from those trees. So now we can remove all of these things, and they are going to give us some stone and some... Uh, uh, what should we call it there? Uh, resin. That's three, four of them. Excellent. And that's not a small amount. It was also commented that I should have removed the, or should have uh, kept the termites uh, because it was an empathy uh, thing and it would give me minus 40 hostility. And I totally forgot about the empathy thing. So with all of that, we need to start working our glade event. Uh, our glade event here is. Um, is blood a blood flower which is going to eat our food of course let's throw a couple people at it and get that cleared as soon as we can uh, they don't need to haul anything there so they should start clearing it right away and it'll be done in three and a half minutes but in that three and a half minutes they're going to eat two items every six seconds so it's going to be a bit uh, rough luckily question mark we don't have any um uh uh cooked food but on the other hand the uh or complex food the complex food is more efficient so it'd be better if it ate the complex food um so that's not always the best let's see we need to get this thing started too here uh that's not there it's also not there here it is because we we need to have a geyser pump to also speed the game up this is three this was four i think right yeah so we should do this out here which means I should also remove one, two more trees right there, too. Yeah. And we might want to put uh, storage out here someplace, uh, just because of this, um, the richness of this, like with the farm, and the farm being here also, and also having some a mine here. So let's put a small storage in. Maybe I should put it right here in this corner, um, or I could put it further this way. Let's put it here, actually. And I'll take this road back actually where does that where's that one supposed to go harvester camp needs to be moved uh this one is supposed to go there um so yeah that would be okay we'll do that we'll go right to there and then we can put the uh, fields in also harvester camp you have more reeds over here you can collect those at your leisure and there's storages nearby so you can deliver to those maybe i will move this over here 
Eh. You know. Uh, the herbalist camp comes back. If we could make the money up for it, it might be a good idea to purchase. Uh, advanced sewing, ancient sewing techniques for, for faster, better coats. That's two out of three of our species. That would be good if we had a coat recipe already. Mushroom production would also be good. Woodcutters, we don't really need the faster, I don't think. Because now it's just a matter of cutting through the trees as we need them. We're doing pretty good on wood, though, surprisingly. Uh, but having a three-star plank recipe helps with that. So I think if we can make up 17, which is going to be a bit tough, because that means we need to make 21, 25 up. The other option is we're going to get 10 from this in a minute and a half. How long are you here for? A minute and 20. All right. I really don't think we can afford to do this, unfortunately. I would have to sell two-thirds of my parts, re remaining parts. That's like 11 of them. At least 10 of them. I don't think we're going to be able to do it. So, sadly, we can't. Let's see, Hilda. Uh, move this again once more. Because I'd like to be able to put a uh, tree cutter back in there when we have the uh, time and or availability. Let's do this here. There's, there's coal or copper there, too. Right. Uh, like now would be a good time, for example. Let's do that. And we're not going to get anything planted this season, but um, that's okay. We started too late. We'll get it all ready to go for next season. Those caches. Uh, we have one cache. So that might be a little bit tough. Um, we could build buildings we're not intending on using and then tear them down after we put the uh, nodes in them. But um, I think that that's not necessarily the best option either. Uh, so Hilda's leaving. That's okay. Let's do this first. If we have a market and give away 50 amber. That's kind of meh. But so is this one. Fill the need for for wine 60 times, which means we'd have to not only be able to make or purchase wine, we'd also have to have a place to sell it. I don't know that I'm going to want to part with that much amber, though. This one's, this one's really... I guess I'll go with this one. This one's really... Ugh. Uh, let's see. Have a kiln and coal. Uh, we don't have a kiln. Or have make a bunch of packs. I would probably then do that one. But I'd like to know that I'm going to have a kiln first. I think I will wait on that one until we get to the next um, the next point here in 11 minutes. I uh, should have looked at these. Packs of crops. I could part with one of these, right? Yes, I could part with one of them. Uh, is that a good deal? No. Perfect. This resin that we're not really going to have a whole lot. We're not going to have any more of, so we could just get rid of what we have. Also not a good deal. Okay, never mind. We could do more packs of crops and the packs of building materials, though, too. I just... The only building material recipe we have that's a good one is planks, and I really don't want to use that much wood. Um, so I don't know that I want to do that either. You have gotten bored over here. Why don't we move you over here, then? And you can come back and help with those. I can bring the road through now. Like this. I missed a tree. Although I guess I could leave it. But I don't want to leave it. Uh, let's see. The blade event finished. So our food has stopped being eaten. Indiscriminately now. And then we should do uh, some housing. Oh dear, we should do some housing. Um, we'll put them in here. Because we don't have another hearth set up yet, right? We were going to put it in here. Oh, that's what we need to do. We need to chop those trees. The mid, mid glade trees are always the worst ones. Come and do that, please. Uh, let's see. Yeah. I love how these trees give meat. <laughs> I think there's one more right there. It sure looks like it anyway. Yeah, I think it is. You are still picking bugs here. 
we've also got meat to pick here and here. This this glade was these two blades here. This area was really good for uh, meat and bug production. We could use um, what should I call it? A, uh, a a jerky recipe that would be kind of nice. Uh, otherwise, a skewer recipe would also be nice. Uh, we really need to complete these trade routes too. I don't think I should worry about starting this up, even though we don't have any rainwater yet. Uh, that's what we should do. That is what we should do. We should have a rain collector here. Um, I think I'll put it over here in this glade. It's actually... Mm, Plague of Darkness. The storm season is 100% longer, and sacrificing is banned. How sad is everybody going to get? Given the number of woodcutters we have, I think we can start with that. Um, you can also hop out of there. That's fine. And where's my other one at? Over here. Pull the humans out first. We're going to have to go a little bit further. Uh, but also these houses. Please. Put those two humans... In, oops, not two beavers. Two humans in there to plow. Uh, we need to get into here yet, but we have another tree to remove. That's okay. Um, and yeah, we have, we have a lot of things to do and less time to do it in. Uh, I'm going to take one from here, I think, but we'll let the lizards come down first. Because they are so, they fall off so slowly that it doesn't hurt to wait. Actually, I could throw you folks back to work for a little while, even. Since it doesn't increase our hostility. Right, I'm stupid. That was really stupid, Lily. Um, yeah. Uh, keep those out, because we could use them to do building. So I'll wait on that. They don't reduce hostility, Wally. Good job. This might help with the lizards, though, too, because... Oh, no, none of them are unhoused. So it won't help. We could potentially do at least one lizard house. Like so. And that might help them as well. People have arrived already. Uh, five or four? Well, we don't have room for anybody. Um, I think... I think I should... Uh, I'd want to... T I would like to take the lizards, but I think this is a better thing overall because of the people and because of the, the stuff. Um, packs of crops again. That's at least a better deal, but, um, well, I don't want to part with those unless we make more. Um, lots of... Let's see the coal we can't make um, at all. We can't even can't even mine it uh, unless we get a kiln. Then we can't. Make, well, I mean, there's other coal recipes, but the kiln's the only one's really worth it. Um, this is good for stone. Stone's not going to be super plentiful, but in order to get three trade routes done, we should potentially consider it. And I think I'm going to do this one, just one of those, and I think we'll do. Um, Let's do just a couple of these, three of these, I think. Let's get a uh, hearth queued up over here. Oops. There you go. I think I'll just go ahead and set this to 12. Although they're out of eggs. Go ahead and switch to meat or bugs on that. Doesn't matter which. Go ahead and return that egg. Somebody can eat it. And there's the lizards unhappy now. Uh, let's just play the game here a little bit. Instead of sacrificing, which because we can't. And instead of... Um, well, I don't know what else we can do, actually. We're at uh, 18 seconds. Let's go ahead and bring in this group of people. Let's go ahead and stick those in there. Oh, yeah. oh you're going to overlap just a tiny bit with that one, too. Nice. Right, actually, leave the favoring on the lizards. As uh, someone mentioned, I can get some nice reputation from that. 
go ahead and do this Autom automaton. Still haven't gotten that built yet. We have. We really need to get building going. Another safe haven, or a safe haven here. That's another minus 40 hostility for every hearth level two. I don't see why not. Uh, except every neighboring town offers plus two more trade routes, but no trade route arrive. Nah. Well, I mean it's not bad, but nah. Economic migration, newcomers will arrive 15% quicker, bring 10% more goods. For every one level standing here with other settlements. That could be good, but I think the hostility is the important thing here. So let's do that. Because the only way to mitigate hostility during the storms now is to favor or unfavor or sacrifice. So I think this is the best option. We should go ahead and plan on doing this as well. I'm going to use this stuff and I'm going to take this here. I don't remember what all I have queued up here, but it's pretty rough. I did, did plant at that one. It's kind of funny. Uh, we should do trade routes. It gives me this. Actually, let's go ahead and turn that in first. Four more people. That means we're going to have to deal with some housing quickly. That is, before the next storm. Uh, let's see. Reeds, we could definitely part with some of those. The deal is not good, though. Not really. Uh, we could part with this grain, because we're not going to get any more anyway. Uh, we could do five stacks of that. And it is a good enough deal that we should just do all five for Stormhaven to get to the next level with them. There we go. Uh, so housing will need to go in here. Uh, we should do um, more lizard housing. Some everybody housing, I guess. As soon as we can get this thing going, which is going to take a little bit of time. Building choice, though. Brewery. Uh, that would take care of the, um, the things we turned down. Uh, we could do Druid's Hut. That would give us some coats. That might be a good idea. It's not my favorite coat recipe, but... Oil could also be potentially good, because we can turn things off the ground into, um... into oil that we can burn as fuel instead of using so many logs. Um, the Better Packs of Crop recipe is kind of a neither here nor there at this point. But the ale and the pickled goods could be good. Uh, where are we at with pickled goods, though? We could do that. Maybe we should do that. <laughs> Tools, pipes, and packs of trade goods. I think I will do the brewery anyway. Okay, I need to put somebody, at least one person, in here. Probably should do two. Uh, we'll do two when it's not the drizzle, because we have the drizzle water pump here. We can go ahead and pull this out, because they're not doing any good anymore anyway. And that way it'll give me the ability to reset it when I need to later on. And we didn't like any more of those. Right, right. I would really like to have a better building material recipe that's not wood. That would be nice. Oh, let's get a couple more lizard houses staged out here. Lizard in there. I do have a lizard in here, right? Yes. Okay. And then, maybe I should have chopped those trees as well. Um, for right now, I'm not going to. I'm going to do some human houses. Yeah, I'll do a couple of humans. And I'll put a couple beavers in as well. We'll do one for right now. These are big ugly, so we're going to take those down eventually. Old Farloff is here. I think I should do beaver civil war. Copper and wood for abandoned caches. Yeah. Definitely should do that one. Now I wish it had given me a, an option for a camp. <laughs> uh, troll game. We could really use a um, copper bar recipe someplace. That would be useful. Um, 
I don't know that that's useful. That, that's that great. I don't know why it's a blue. It should be less than that. It's not that much stuff for opening a cache. Um, for 18 amber, that is. Uh, so I think we just sit on it at this point, maybe. Alright. Oh, let's put a couple humans in this. Uh, it's gonna make a difference. Forget it. Never mind. What should you get planted? Not very many. We need we needed that hearth out here. They were having to go too far to rest. Okay. Hmm. What are you doing? You might need some help for a little while. Here's the next order, so we, should, we gotta make a decision here on this one. I don't really want to make a bunch more packs, although this would help. That would give us 30 of the 60 I think we need of the wine, but... Mm, I really, really, really want to have a kiln. Any of these close to being ready to turn in? Nah, not really. So I haven't gotten a jerky recipe. That's why another reason why I want the kiln. Um, turn this one on. Put somebody in here. A uh, human. Don't really want you making ale uh, yet. But if you do, then you're going to make it with that. Pickled goods, though. You can pickle the mushrooms for sure. Uh, again, you can use whatever you got available to you. And then packs of crops we're going to not handle right now. But we may make more. We may have to make more. Uh, may have to make. Where are we at with? Wait, do I have a better brick recipe? Why do I have that one turned off? I don't think I do. I just turned it off for some reason. Okay. Uh, clay it is for this. Um. a lot of reeds, but we also don't have many left. We have more clay, and if we get mines going, we'll have more from the secondary from the copper. We have a lot more clay. Hmm, maybe I should do this packs anyway. And so I'll have to make 12 more packs of crops. We make those here. You can use either of those, I guess. Put somebody else in here. Um... Not great. I don't like it. Do this anyway. Uh, put somebody in here and use the bricks, I guess. Um, and I'm going to put some more support in here to help you make those things faster. And let's boost these then too. When we have the water to do so. I don't like it. Alright. It is what it is. Let's get those done. Oh, we need to make those 12s also. Uh, you're a 12. And you're a 12. Traders leaving. That's fine because I don't think there's anything else I wanted from here. Uh, I could have, I should have been refavoring the, the lizards again because they're happy enough to give us a little bit extra here. And I'd like to get that so that we can see what we might get for another building and maybe we'll get a kiln. Don't like it still, but I'm trying it anyway. Do this here and pull one of these out to go and do that. Like this. We need a park or something here. Um. That'll work. And you're just about done back here. Although I did select a regular tree. Let's turn that off. There we go. Chop, chop. Lots of charges there. Good. We have these over here too that are within comfortable distance in those even. I might have to take one of those trees out, but that's okay. I'm still saying we're going to probably go to this one, but we honestly don't really need that fertile soil that much. 
This one was where? Back there? Did I even check? Yes, I did. It was back there. So we actually need to remove two more trees right here. They might as well clear out these big ones, but actually, no, not right now. Uh, we should do the do the thing first. Uh, as soon as you or you are done. So it's going to be you because you've got... Yeah. Okay. Let's see how this goes. Uh, we're probably going to end up pulling this out. We'll see. Um, we may have to do some sacrificing either way. So if we're going to do that, we might as well do it. Do it right. Do it good. Put another in there. Get those packs going. You'll be fast enough compared to the brick production that will be okay there. And uh, Plague of the Dark Forest. Hostility from discovered dangerous and forbidden glades is increased by 15. Is that only during this plague or is that a permanent increase? I hope it's just temporary. It's gonna be bad enough as it is. Ooh. Wow. Okay, I'm gonna keep the lizards favorite until they fall below their threshold anyway, which is uh, 15. And then maybe I can unfavor them if the beavers get a little too soft. And I'm still tempted to remove all those trees right there. Uh, let's prioritize this one. After they started on other things, of course. And as soon as we get bricks, we can do that. Alright, they're going. They're going. We used a bunch of bricks for construction. Two. Okay, you're done. You can come back over here and take care of those couple of trees. We can get another farm in here. Uh, I need to put two humans in this, which means that I need to pull one of them out of something else and put a lizard in their place. Should have done that already. Oops. And then we'll get uh, more stuff done. There's our people again, because we had the longer season and I took them early uh, in the last year. Four or five? Well, three lizards is useful either way. Seven pottery is pretty good. I don't remember what the ratio is compared to that, but the extra person is probably more worth it anyways. So let's take that, and we had enough buffer that we could get uh, them all in here, too. Uh, actually, I'm not going to bother with that, because we're going to go positive again in a moment. Fiber delivery line. But given what we're trying to do here, I think we should take this one before we can spend it all. So let's do... Let's do that, because we're trying to make packs with poorer recipes, and being in conserving what we're getting is probably the better option. Uh, maybe, maybe not. But we should take that one anyways, I think. And that'll give us boosts on this production, as well as uh, this production. Right away. Actually, I don't know if it's right away, right away, or not. Let's reset you just in case. And you're already reset, so it doesn't matter. Uh, let's do a trade, maybe. Coal. All right, we're going to get a building now. There it is. <sighs> um, nope. This is a little more viable now, at least. So maybe I should just do it. Let's just do it. I don't know if I'll get a kiln. And then this one. What's with all the packs? I don't really care about this one. Because by the time I get that, I don't want it. Uh, let's go ahead with this one then, I guess. All the packs. Uh, then maybe a pack of building materials, better recipe, might be a good idea here. Training gear wouldn't hurt either. Tools are good, too. The clothier would give us the better coats, though. The market would be good for that carry, plus a place to fulfill the need for luxury. Uh, I think I need to go with this, though, with the packs of building materials, given, given the demands here. I think I have to. I feel like I have to. Yeah, let's do it. So let's stop making these. 
Oops. Put you back in there. Uh, let's do this Tinkerer. Like so. Okay, you might as well keep going on these, these big uglies then. Oh, I left one of them selected, but it was not in in reach, so that was okay. Uh, we could put up a thingy down here. What about trades? We already said no to the trade. Grr, arg. Uh, let's go ahead and put that mine up, though. Because we could potentially start working at If I had the tree cut. Dang it. Let me borrow you for a moment. Okay, let me cut that tree. Because you only have one more to cut right there. And it won't take you long to cut one. Like so. Mine. Hmm. Okay. I think we should remove these trees right here because it's just too good to have a bunch of houses right there. Uh, so let's do that. We put another human house in, maybe, right here. And another lizard house in, maybe, right here. Find the door here. There it is, so... There. Let's do this. More people that we don't have housing for. And uh, you are bored. Because you made them too fast. Oh, you're done. Uh, is this done? Yes, this is done. Then that beaver can come and work here, making just packs of building... Packs of building materials out of bricks up to 12. And we need eight more. All right. We can turn this one down, although we'll need it again for that. And here... Probably shouldn't look a gift horse in the mouth for, mouth for more coat for coats again. On the other hand, copper bars would be really nice. And biscuits couldn't hurt either because we're making flour right now with nothing to use it on. Um, a better brick recipe could be nice too, though. Not to mention a pottery recipe. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Uh... Let's go to the brickyard. I shake my head at you, game. I shake my head at you. And I really need some more room. Uh, somewhere near storage to put this building in. So, I think what I will do is move you over. Get somebody to come up here and take out these two trees right here. Because, again, minimizing the trees. Not that one. This one. And we'll put that in, and I will stop making bricks here. Uh -huh. Just the fabric. Good. You'll deliver the six you have, and we'll be one bit short. Dang it. I think I'll maybe allow you to make one batch with fabric as well. Uh, good, you're done, actually. Maybe I won't need to. Um, let's see. You can come down here and help with this, I guess. For the moment. It's fine. Uh, let's put that brick yard in here. Get that done quickly. It'll be nice. Maybe I won't do that. Yeah, go ahead and do it. Go ahead and do it. I think I should allow this fuel to be used. Um, for burning in the thing. And then we put in somebody here to make just the bricks for the moment. With the clay, that's fine. Oh good, you're done. 
Did I miscount? I guess I did. Good. Uh, so I can allow you to make other things then, too. Maybe a few tools. Um, trapper needs to move. How about some meat for a while? Harvester is done, I think. Yeah, Harvester is done. Alright, I'll just leave you here then. Pull that out. Um, these, this is ready to go. Let's go ahead and do this. We can move on to the next level. Alright. Golden Blood. Standing level 2 with 3 settlements on trade routes. 5 reputation points from events. Or 6 reputation points from resolve. That one will come as it comes. Um, this one, though, I think we can actively work on. Standing level 2 with 3 settlements. We need to actively work on it, though. How about selling some reeds? Well, we've used up all the reeds we have, but that's also a good enough deal that we could do it. Uh, we could make... We could make 10 coins from that. The meat? Um, 234 and 2 is barely even, I would say, without doing actual math. Uh, I'd rather not send the coal... Um, I don't have any packs of provisions, though. Forgot about that. Let's see what we can save up for. Did I did not take? Oh, wait, that's from the from turning in the thing, right? Wood cutting speed was increased by ten percent for every one hundred fifty units of rainwater used in rain engines. Eh, two wild for essence for every two completed dangerous or forbidden glade events. Maybe. Your scouts have learned to be cautious when looting abandoned caches. Uh, hostility is lowered by 15 points. Let's do that one just because, again, hostility. Uh, we're going to probably open this glade up next year, so that would be okay to do um, because we'll probably get a cache in there. Okay, so back to the trades. Oh, we don't have packs of provisions, right. Why are you idle? You should be making packs of provisions. And you can probably go back to 10. It would probably be fine. Actually, no, you can't. You need to go to... Nope, you can. Okay, this needs to be 15 now, though. And so does building materials need to be 15. Once you get some bricks in. And then trade goods are here. We could start those probably with flour. Um, thinking... Wait, I'm not making flour yet. Let's start making flour. Oopsie. I thought I was. Nope, wrong thing again. Wrong again. Let's go with mushroom flour. Followed by root flour. And, um, because we are getting some roots from here, although I may end up turning the roots off there. Eh. Eh. Um, yeah, you're on those. That's good. We may switch this to herbs at some point, though. Barrels we could make any time. Uh, we don't have a whole lot of metal, but we could, we could make some more. Maybe. Um. I have a buggy. Do I want the flour? Do I want to use the pottery that we can't replace? Or we can replace it. Six pottery or six flour. So this would be... Six flour would be like... Five mushrooms-ish. Uh, pottery would be... Not there. Pottery would be... Three clay and one sea marrow for five. So a little bit more than that for six. Right now, I think we should make it out of flour. We didn't end up taking that biscuit recipe, right? No. Uh, right. So we definitely need more packs of provisions. Oh, the next trees. How about we come back over here? Like that. You can get those couple of uglies that are back there. Because you're going to be bored as well here. Uh, let's see. We can get some more uglies. Oh, we can get these uglies right here, too. These big uglies right here. Do, 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 do. That should be safe. Small glade's not that dangerous anyway. And uh, then we'll get those when we're ready to pop into that glade. Probably use another worker in here. Probably should have had one all along. Uh, we need to put somebody else in here because we want to get clearance water coming in. 
And uh, where's my third woodcutter at? Guess I can just click and click and click. Oh, you're still down there. Oh, yes, you are still down there. I never put the humans in this either. Oopsie. Move this closer. Just as we can. And our last one. 20, vi two vi 20 villages of religion need fulfilled. Well, we could accomplish that if we had the ability to make it, plus delivering the incense. That's coal, parts, and people, or a hundred of each of these waters to give away. That would be tough, given that we don't have pumps for them, and we'd have to stop using them in machines. But I think it's worth it to try. So let's do that. You know, to Hilda's here. I uh, don't really need the plantation. Berries and plant fiber might be good. Uh, additional global resolve would be good. Basically global resolve, not quite global. I could buy a reputation, half a reputation point. Um, it would give me another building choice. Probably would give me the kiln choice that I wanted. Um... I don't know what else I want to buy. I never know what I want to buy. I rarely know, I should say. I could buy some bricks that might be useful. Let's buy that half a point. I could buy bricks with what I have for cash here. Um, or fabric at that point, it doesn't matter, I guess, technically. But I think I will buy the bricks. Um, I can buy them all. So why don't we buy some fabric too? Unless there's other stuff that I want. I could buy more food. We could always do with food, but they don't have very much food. I could really do with a freaking complex food recipe. But let's just do this. We'll balance out. It balances evenly even. Evenly even. There we go. Let's do it. And we don't have to make fabric for quite a while. Actually, I should even pull you out of there. Because we might as well. So Hilda, you can be quiet. And, um, yeah. Building choice, right. Leather worker would get us a good fabric recipe now that we've bought a bunch of fabric. This gets us a poor coal recipe, but also gets us an incense recipe. Not that that helps me now, but also gets us a really good pie recipe. Uh, we don't really need this. If I were, I would rather take the leather worker. But tool shop isn't going to help a whole lot except for with pipes. We have a lot of pipes. The leather worker is actually not a bad idea. I would just really like to have a jerky recipe for this here. Um, but this is worth it, I think, so I'm going to take it anyway. And that means I need to borrow somebody. Uh, Let's see, where are they all at? There, there. Let's go, let's take you. Um, come up here. And I need to remove a few more trees here. I think... Maybe... One, two... That many. Three trees, right there. We'll put the leather worker in. I could part with 21 ale for that price. Let's do it. Uh, the reeds now, um, I could still part with those, but do I need to? Yeah, that would get them to level two. Uh, the meat would get Beverton to level one and then some. I should do that one first then. Let's do that also. All right. Ready to departure. Goodbye. I have seven workers that I could use that could use a job. Um, who is working hard at something and could use some help? Well, I can put two people in this actually right away. That'll take care of two of them. 
Uh, we could always do some more foraging, too. We could do some more mining. Uh, wait a minute. Why? Oh, because of Plague of Locusts. Destroyed six random resource nodes. We lost mushrooms over here. Roots over there. Meat there. Clay there. And clay there, next to it. And meat there. Ouch. Alright. Troll game. Alright. It is what it is. Uh, this, though, frustrated means they're going to eat... Or they're going to lose two, two resolve. Unless they have the complex food. Okay, game. Uh, we can turn that off. You can send those back. Um, I can probably even delete that. No, we need the part. We need it for the pipes yet. All right. This is bored. Um, that's too far away. Dang it. Let's ignore that one for right now, and let's do... Can I do either of those? No. We're probably going to pop that one then to get through, and then we'll do the big ones later. Alright, I'm going to have to give this a rest. Blizzards will go down to minus one, but that's okay. Uh, I could reduce hostility a little bit to get rid of this, but I'm kind of okay with it right now. Kind of okay. I'm through the road. Hmm. Oh, uh, leather worker. Get that built too. Four builders, that's okay. Since I have actually things to build. We can also put a few more houses up here. Um. Although, I should actually put decorations up there first. Let's go with a uh, garden here. And we can do maybe some fence corners back here. Yeah, back here. Can I get another hearth out here? Uh, maybe if I put it back here, I could. Yeah, eventually we'll do that. Alright, go ahead and do that one. Surgical Strike. And we'll come across here with a road, too. Eventually. I need to upgrade these housing. This housing, too. These housing? Yeah, well. We have some favor here. Although it didn't really help much. Work safety guide. Education. So that's just beavers. Increases global production speed by 5%. If we had scroll recipe, I don't think we do. And if we had a place to sell them. Uh, Seal is used by 10 points every time you sell goods worth 30 amber. We could come back to that one. Or 10% villager speed, one global resolve. We could come to that one too. Uh, 3, 2, 1 is 6. 3, 2, 1 is 6. Probably go with the beavers because we could use them in the mine. And the extra pipes wouldn't hurt. Some coats would be okay. We don't really need the herbs and now we don't really need the fabric. So that would be okay to do as well. Um, let me know your thoughts there. Turn that off, because she's not going to get to the thing anyway. You're all ready to go here. You, you were still plowing. Uh, you can only plot half your fields. We could put in, as I mentioned before, some extra herb gardens. Um, in order to do that, I would want to put like right in here, or maybe right in here, which means we'd have to remove some more trees. So we could do that to help boost the production of these two. But right now, I think we're okay with it. I'd rather keep covering fields rather than um, extra coverage on existing fields uh, given that I can easily add two more workers like that uh, and then we, we keep forgetting to look at these um, some of the things we might want to look at this time would be um, where is how many packs do I have that set to by the way trade goods 
Oh, uh, that should be set to 15, which they made 15, so that's good. But we don't need more than that. But I'll put it up to 15 anyways, just in case. Because I might use them later. Um, packs of crops, trade goods, building materials, building materials. Yeah. Uh, so I don't really know what charts to look at here. I guess we could look at, like, things like clay is just struggling. I might might be worthwhile to put another stone cutter up just to get more clay in. Uh, we haven't... We haven't gained or lost any coal so it's been steady the entire time um parts have gone down and up uh wood wood has gone steadily up always so we're actually producing more wood than we need uh which doesn't surprise me since i have eight or nine woodcutters going at it constantly uh things like water could be something to look at too we had none and now we're stabilizing right around 100 we should um probably put up another one of these at least as storage because we're going to need it for these if we ever get there but in order to get there we're going to need to stop spending it so we should um we should probably consider that but i think we're in a good spot for today so if you have any thoughts on which cornerstone i should choose uh and or which party i should choose by all means and then hopefully we can get another one of these uh trade routes done we could turn that in and we could do some more Ooh, we should definitely do that one if it's worth it it is worth it Let's go with five of those. Go sick. And then, because uh, that'll get that to level two, and then we just need to get a couple more to level two to get this here good. Um, and we can look at more trades once the other one finishes in a few seconds next episode. So thank you all for joining me, and I will see you all next time. Bye for now.